All right, what is up, ladies and gentlemen? Wait and see how long gets some of you guys to arrive. All right, there's the notification. Good, good. So I feel like it's been a little while since we've streamed. I don't know. It's only, I mean, it's only been like what, not even a week, but I don't know. For some reason, that feels like a lot. All right, let's wait for some of you guys to get here. Holy shit, alright, there's already, I didn't say anyone was in, but then there's a whole bunch of you commenting already. Ooh, Hikatsuki is first, what's up? Kinsley, John, D-Man, Sky, JP, K. Malinsky, Levi, AWOL, Mr. Shinks, <laughs> Gervang, King Ed, ooh, King Edric, it has been a while, my man, good to see you. Gage, what's going on? Beanie Walrus, Dijon Mustard, Kyrie, uh, Tyler McDougal. Teen Woo TV, Danny Jeter, Bacon. All right, boys. So uh, I guess the title and the description should be pretty self-explanatory, but um, Prisno version 0 0.9, a big update just came out uh, within the last couple days. And obviously we're in the middle of a Prisno campaign, um, but we're going to be switching over to the new version. Uh, I'm going to be carrying our character over um, and like bringing some of like what we owned already before. So it's kind of going to be like starting a new series, but we're already going to have the levels and whatnot. So it should be, we we'll should, should be able to get through the first part a lot quicker. So it won't be as grinding and we'll still be able to see Raleigh's story, uniting the elves, all that stuff just with the new version, which to be honest, I don't even know what all is in it. So I should probably look that up right now and we can go over that together. So let me look this up real quick. Prisno 0.9. All right, let me get on this tale worlds form and see if they got any explanations as to what exactly is new okay 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 right, let me turn this off here there we go so here's the prisoner 0, 0 0.9 um so let's see female giants is a new race uh new optional trading screen what is this new beginning Hmm. What's the difference? Why is this? Why do they change that? Not really sure what the reasoning behind that is. The description video. Okay, deal button. It buys and sells items to and from. So after. Oh, oh, sell after button. Sells all items after a selected item. Sells all items before it. Oh. Interesting. Okay. Okay. All right, whatever. Moving on. Uh, so there's new quests. Uh, mm, added end game quest. The fuck does that mean? What does that can involve? A major third legion quest. A minor quest from a scholar in Galway. Um, added weapon breaking in hard mode. Well, guess who's not gonna be playing on hard mode? <laughs> Fucking this guy. I hate weapon breaking. Um. Alright, added dwarf and giant companions. Oh shit, nice. More top tier infantry from Tolrania, Valley here, Prisno, and Geldar. Interesting. More branches of nobles for Jahara Hack and Tolrania. Second tier nobles for Zan. Bear cavalry for Arulo. Holy shit. Uh, revamp the dwarves, the dwarven models, their armor, weapons, troop trees. Okay. Okay, okay. Slightly buffed red immortals. Okay, all right. Items. Here's the important one. Uh, LODs for... They added LODs for giant's armor and many other items. I'm not sure what that means. Added helmet, shield, several tribal weapons for... And a bear for a rulo. Okay. Vampirism effect for the dreaded sword. Oh, I'm getting excited. New armors, new weapons, new horses. New dreaded one armor set. What the fuck? Madness effect for the leaf bombs. Troops that were directly hit when received damage start attacking anyone around them. They revamped over a couple hundred ranged and melee weapons. Some significantly, some not. Interesting. Uh, they removed the last day's armor. Interesting. Interesting. 
What is this? Spoiler, beware. The fuck is that guy? What the hell is this? Hold up. Oh, that's doing the opposite of what I want. Oh, that's not helping either. How do I, what, what is going on here? What is this? What is this dude just standing here in the middle of like what appears to be like a cemetery? All right, guys. Well, that's what we're looking at right now. Um, let's uh, let's get into like converting him over. Oh, yikes. Let's see. Prisno now at 0 0.9. Let's get this started. <laughs> this, this, looks, this looks like a big update, boys. This looks like a good one. <laughs> Brendan, yeah, yeah, that Warsaw Conquest series, it did kind of look like we were riding a testicle with teeth. That's what the squids are. Or the squibs, what are they called? <laughs> uh, I will be playing a little bit of Little Perusno. We'll be updating it. We're going to be doing some stuff to try to get the series ready, and then I'm going to be recording the first couple episodes tonight. I feel like I should start the series on Friday, right, when all of you guys are free? Isn't that, should I do that? I feel like I should be starting the series on a Friday. Even though it's technically not a new series, I know, but it's kind of a new series. I feel like I should start on Friday. And then, then guys, Friday, th three episodes, all right? Three episodes, first day, I'm calling it, okay? As long as YouTube doesn't fuck me over again, man. I'm not gonna lie, YouTube's been doing some weird shit with the uploads, and it has not been fun on my part. Like, it randomly, like, I never set my videos to private. Never. And so, when I release videos, the last couple times I've released videos, right away, like, right after the bat, YouTube's, I try to click on it, YouTube's like, oh, this video is private, I'm sorry, you can't watch this, it's unavailable. And it's like, excuse me, I just released it, should be public for everybody, and it stays like that for like 10, 15 minutes sometimes. And so the notification goes out right away, and then people click on it, and then it's like, oh, JK, it's private, you can't watch it. And then there's like, all right, well, I guess it's gone. And then 15 minutes from then, they're able to watch it, but they don't know that it's available because it only sent out the notification at the beginning. It's really frustrating. I'm not sure what's going on with it. Who knows? Maybe when YouTube went down yesterday, um, <laughs> they fixed that. <laughs> I don't know. All right, so let's play Perizno here. Oh, fuck, we're going to have to redesign him. What did Raleigh even look like? Wasn't he? He was a ginger, right? <laughs> Something like that. What's up, Yaya? Uh, and yeah, gaming... Gaming lives. Yeah, we're definitely going to uh, be acquiring some Marulo units. That sounds fucking dope. <laughs> What's up, Jason? Balladier? You think Perizno is better than Pendor? Oh, I, 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 Perizno's been doing a lot of work, man. They've been right behind Pendor for so long. It, it's close, man. It really it really is close. Uh, Toggle Fog War. No, thank you. Toggle Troop Proficiency Level. I don't know what that means. So, we'll just do that. Oh, shit. This is new. Choose your gender. Triggered. There's only two of them. How dare... <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, race. We're gonna... Oh my god. What is this? Yo. This is actually kind of cool. Let me go elf, baby. Elf. Man. Information. You are a man. Alright. Elf. There we go. History. None of this matters because we're just going to be copying our stats over. Review. Good enough. Good enough. Um, your status is great enough. You should be given a banner. Fuck, what was our banner, boys? I don't remember what our banner was. Do any of you guys remember what our banner was? I mean, some of this shit looks dope. Like, whatever the fuck that is. What was our banner? What were we doing? This one looks pretty dope. I feel like this is should be what it is, even if it isn't. Were we doing, like, some... Hmm... Were we doing something that was like symbolizing uniting the two elven people? I don't remember if we were or not. There's a bunch of cool shit here. I like that, dude. Honestly, I like this one, man. <laughs> so we're, we're just going to do that. Realistic, because mama ain't raised no bitch. Uh, I got to make sure I spell this right. So I'm pretty sure it was Raleigh Burval. Spelled like that. We need to make sure it's spelled like that, because otherwise the importing will not work. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Once again, these don't matter. We're going to be importing our stats anyways. Good stuff. Um, okay. So the face there works. The face is fine. We just need to make him a ginger. And then probably change his hair, because what in the fuck is that mess? Perfect. All right, there we go. We're solved. Problem solved. Fuck, I just clicked off of the live stream. I'm sorry, boys. Hold up. 
Let me uh, <laughs> let me get it back on. I want to be reading your boys' comments. Uh, let's see what we got. I got enough charge now. I can actually just sit down and put it up here so I can look easier. Holy shit. TJ Risk. I think that's TJ Risk. $2 donation. Thank you, man. Uh, when are you continuing the winter? Um, more commonly now. Basically, the last three weeks, I've been really busy. Every weekend, I I've been going back and working like 30, 40 hours a week. Or a weekend. And so that's normally when I stream. Um, we will be doing more Witcher. Don't you worry. We're definitely going to get that done. Oh, fuck. Do I have my volume on? A little bit. Okay. Um, yeah, so seriously, though, what hair did we have? It was, like a little, it was this, wasn't it? It was basically like this. I feel like he wasn't quite the default. Like, his face is maybe... Maybe temple width needs to be brought in a little bit. Honestly, for the most part, it's not bad. His chin, I don't know why he's, like... They don't know what a jawline is. Like, the jawlines weren't discovered until, like, 2014 in gaming. <laughs> like, <laughs> uh, oh, well, good enough. We'll be wearing a helmet. It doesn't fucking matter. All right, Lintorin Nation, here we go. Okay. So, first thing is first, let's see if this works. Import character. Fuck, did I spell it wrong? I think I did spell it wrong. VMP hit Alt F4. Why are you trying to tell me to do that, man? Was it with an I there? Or a vol like that, perhaps? Maybe that's what it was. Oh, there we go. Boom! All right. Raleigh's back. Cool. 31, 14, 26, 13. I feel like we should scale back the level, right? Maybe we should bring it back to, like, level 15. We don't want to do it with one. We'll bring it back to, like, a level 15. That way, like, we actually level up at some point in the series. Um, I think I might do that. I think I might do that. I can do that after this, though. All right, so I made a list. So obviously, we don't want to like have every start out the series with everything we had before. But I made a list of all the different uh, locations that we owned land in. Let me see how many. How many is this? Probably about twenty or so. Probably roughly about twenty some locations that we own land. I feel like we should get back half of those. I feel like we should get back half of those. So let's do like the elven ones. Let's keep the elven ones. We'll do like the elven ones here, Kaltaka. We'll do like down here. Maybe more, more over here, I don't know. I'm not sure where we should actually do that at. But in order to do that, so we have 95,000 orms. That's not bad. Daddy needs some more money though. Your boy needs some more money. What's up, Powell Kublak? Your first live stream? Good to see you, man. Glad you're here, my dude. Agent of Chaos is in here? Hey, what's going on? <laughs> Agent of Chaos. No banning. No banning. Unless they deserve it. What's up, Holy Master? Name me, cuz? What do you mean? Yeah, we're not trying to waste all that work. Obviously, we don't want to start off with, like, everything, because, like, we're already decent ways into the series, but we don't want to lose everything either. So, let's see. Let's see how much 250k gets us. If that gets us, like, 10... We'll, we'll put a number on it. We'll say 10 Enterprises. We'll buy 10 Enterprises back. Obviously, and then we're not going to buy any of the land that we had bought, like, the farmland that we had bought before. Oh, I forgot. We got to go through and, like, talk to all the Tavern Masters, be like, yo... Give everybody some wine. And then, hey, let me get some land. <sighs> the fuck do you mean you could know me a little better? Bruh. You guys love me here. Look at this shit. Eh, look, I already got a one with you guys. God damn it, what do I need to do? Hold up. How do you go to the cheap menu so I can get myself some renown? Because that's the other thing is I don't want to have to redo all my renown and stuff because that would take a while. <laughs> but no, seriously, how do you... Oh, is this in camp menu maybe? Change game settings. Ooh, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Horse speed limitation. Okay, nope, that's already off. Good. <laughs> they know me well. Uh, stamina bar... What? Enable combat sprinting? Yeah, I'm alright. <laughs> I'm alright on that. Do 
You guys know how I can cheat myself some renown? Cheat menu? Do I have to do that? Like, hold up. What is it? Like this? Cheat menu on? I don't know if that worked. Did I just do cheat menu? Hey, there we go. Awesome. Okay. Uh, increase player renown. 200. What were we at? We were at like 1,200, right? Or 1,300? We were just enough that we were past the princess, right? So we needed to do this five more times. Okay. I should put us roughly where we were. Honor, I don't know what we were at. Let's do like 33. I feel like that's roughly enough. It's not too much. Um. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Alright, that should be pretty good. So let's see. I wonder if they'll let us talk to them now. Or let us buy shit now. Alright, what the fuck is this? What the fuck is this? How much relations do we have to have with the town in order for them to like me? Do you guys know? Also... You can just turn off the cheat menu now, cheat menu off for right now. Is that the same at every town? Is every town just not going to like us? Because that's going to be really fucking annoying if that's the case. We're going to have to like come back to every place and do it multiple times, I think, then. How much relationship do you need? This was supposed to not be this difficult. What the fuck? How's it going, Alice Lane? Ah, <sighs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Fifteen. Get the fuck out. Max and Jason both said fifteen. What's up, Lucas Coke? The Urkosh. You need fifteen relation with each town. For real. Okay, if that is indeed the case, if that is indeed the case, then, um, hmm, we're going to take this 250k, and we're just going to invest it in land all over the place, I think, then. And then, I guess part of the series is going to be us going around and trying to please all the townspeople enough. Holy shit, man. It goes down with good persuasion? We have decent, I mean, we have four persuasion. It's not horrible. What's up, Anthony? He's saying, everyone's saying 15. D-Man thinks it's 5. Last time I ran it, it was 5. What's up, Forbes? Really? Also, how do I turn this goddamn cheat menu? I, we'll keep it on, actually, for right now, because we, I want to get a little bit of our equipment back. Not all of it, but, like, something decent. And I want to check out the new armors, most importantly. Um, <laughs> so let's... All right. All right, all right, so let's get some of this shit. So let's see, 48 acres of land, we'll buy 38 of that. 40? Buy 38 of that. All right, there went like half our money right there. Oh. Oh. Okay, landlord's here. There's only 14 acres, so we can buy like, God, like what, half of them? We'll buy like half of them, all right. Why are they so, ooh, buy a ship. What the, f what the fuck are ships for? Hold up. Okay, no, there's no new factions, are there? I feel like they, they could definitely be putting factions here. Or at least make Kelteca bigger. The Rulos, make them bigger. Um, I should have done that right away, though. Let's check to make sure there's no new factions. I didn't say anything about new factions, so I, I didn't think there would be. Um, yeah, so I guess let's just spend the rest of the money on the Elven ones. Start out with a, with a small loan of 250,000 orms. That's what we're doing here, boys. <laughs> um, 45 acres of land, so we'll buy 35. That's basically all of our money. All right, we need a little more money than that. We need a little more money than that, then. So at least get the elven towns to have maxed out uh, stuff. Then that will be all right. Type in, oh, it's a no cheat menu? Gotcha. But VMP, if you put on armor, we can't see those sick delts. 
Oh wait, the delts? Oh, you're talking about the delts. Got it. You're talking about the traps for a little bit. You gotta, 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 gotta give these boys some love too. No. <laughs> All right, 70k. Is that enough for Elsinore? How much? How much land they got here? Oh right, yeah, we only need like 21 here. Boom. Okay, so there's a little bit of money left over. Okay, so money-wise, should be sorted now. We should be sorted now. They're gonna add more factions at 1.0 as a major update. That, that would make sense. Um. Mm, okay. So let's go back, cheap menu, find items. Let's let's go searching, boys. Let's see if we can find some of the new shit they put in. Actually, how many ranges are there? Or how many items are there in total? Oh my god, what was that, nearly 3,000? What the fuck? All right, we're gonna be searching for a while, boys. <laughs> uh, War boar. There we go. All right, cool, cool. Wait, 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 hold up. Choose from this range. What do they have there? They say they had the uh, elven spirit horse. That's what we were using before, right? We're using some sort of elven horse, I thought. That was pretty tanky. But it says riding a six, and we obviously don't have that. So I guess maybe I was wrong. Maybe we were using something else. Oh yeah, this is this is what we're using right here. The uh, the Draharan war elephant. Damn it, can't ride it. <laughs> Tigers, Fire Dragon, Nightmare, Jesus. The High Dragon, this is what Herzog Oscar rides. Look at this thing, you thought the regular dragon was good. 90 armor, 500 hit points, 100 charge. How about this thing? 800 hit points, 120 armor, 130 charge. Get out of here. <laughs> Don't stand a chance with that thing. That's it, dude, that... <laughs> I wish you could loot that thing off of Herzog Oscar. That would be fucking dope. Or if you could, like, capture him and take the dragon. Obviously, that wouldn't make a ton of sense because, you know, it's a dragon. It makes its own decisions. It's not just like a horse. But, uh, that would be pretty, pretty dope. <laughs> Alice Lane, gotta, gotta give credit to all the muscles. Why, just, why spend all the time in the gym if no one notices? Exactly, exactly. Oh my god, Prisno Plated Charger. Why does this horse look so goddamn thick? It's got tiny little legs. It does, it, this guy doesn't spend the time in the gym. It, it doesn't hit leg day. It's just chest day every day for this horse. I mean, I take it if we if we could. We can, Obviously, we don't <laughs> we don't have enough riding for it. We, like, don't have enough riding for any of these horses, man. What the fuck? All right. Perfect. <laughs> oh man. Uh. <laughs> Should have looked at the new bear. Oh shit, was it there? I missed it then. Oh well. Next item range. I don't think we're going to see anything too crazy in here. I, I feel like all the new items are going to be at the end. Uh, da -da -da. Oh, whoops, I, I didn't even move it forward there. Yeah, this is all just the old armor, I think, for the most part. We, I, I don't want to buy back the same armor we had before, because it's a, it's a little too OP. Let's give him a six-pack. Oh, no. Why does he look so fat when he puts that on? I think it's because of the neck. The neck, like, it, it shrouds his neck, and it makes it look like his neck is, like, this fucking wide. All right, back to the dress. He looks, he looks beautiful in the dress. Demon queer, or queer, queer, boily. Okay, I was not trying to say queer there. Okay, uh, that looks a little bit better. <laughs> I'm fat, so every day is leg day. <laughs> Just moving around. I got gotcha, you. I got gotcha. you. All right, this is uh pretty decent, but I don't think that really fits the character though. It's an, it's it's good armor, but it's not great armor. It's like mid tier armor. So that's and that's what we're looking for right now. Prisoner Twilight Noble Armor. Surprisingly, the stats on that really aren't that great. Ooh, this actually looks kind of dope. Nope, never mind. Looked better on paper. Then you put it on and it's like, eh. Mm. Guess not. Guess not. All right, next one. Let's go. What do we got? Mosoru Warlord Armor. Yeah, no. Nah. That ain't it, Chief. He called. He said that ain't it. 
Um, Geldrin Cape Dimer, this is even better, but that's a little too good for us to start off a series with, right? Oh, hello, we're getting to some of the weapons. What is this? Luke Praying Mentis Sword, Court Blades Brights. What the fuck? It's like, I think these are unfinished weapons that they didn't actually, they haven't actually brought in yet. Interesting. Okay. What's up, BMP? Yo, BMP Show. I've been seeing your comments on all my Pathfinder Kingmaker series. And I didn't notice at first, and then I was like, BMP Show. Oh, he's copying me. Why is it a B instead of a V? What's up, Zarkus? Uh, what we're doing right now is we're trying to transfer over Raleigh from our 0 0.8 version of Prisno to 0 0.9. Basically, that's what's going on right now. Um, so we're trying to get him some like decent armor, but not great armor, because we don't want to be too overpowered right off the start. I don't like any of those, really. And I'm using this as an excuse to look through and see all the new armors. Okay, now we're starting to get into some of the better ones. Geldrin Heavy Scale Mail? Yo, that looks dope right there. And its stats are pretty fucking good. 6230. If you could get like a lordly version of that, it's pretty nice. Okay, moving on. I think this next one is going to have some of the big boy ones. Lintorn knightly armor. See, this just looks shitty. I don't know. Maybe if you had a helmet on, it would look better. Rev Spartan armor. Interesting. Prisno runed armor. Why does that look so plain? Doesn't even have any runes on it. Uh, demon armor. Okay, okay, okay. Ruined Prisno noble armor. Gosh. Okay, this one's starting to get pretty good. 566 and 40. Okay. Yeah, it's pretty good. Golden elven scale armor. Yo. Okay. No, there's definitely some good armor left in here. Definitely some good armor left. All right. Let's skip down a little bit. See what we're looking at here. Tauranian champion plate. Yup, yup, yup. Okay. Dragons. Oh my god. Okay. Let's start. Let's start here. Enchanted elven armor. All right. 271.34. Human sized Kakoff MK armor. Fountain guard armor. Dragon scale armor. Demon lord armor. I wonder if that's part of the dreaded one set. So 72.31. 1273.35. Dragon Knight, 7334, okay, kind of meh. Silver Ruined Prisno Noble Armor, 874 and 50. Jesus Christ. That's even better than the Paladin Armor. Okay, I don't know how you would get that, but we want it. We want that, like, really bad. Okay? We want that really bad. <sighs> Reasons unknown. <laughs> Bears can eat your enemy. Oh, okay. Okay, Tempting Clown. I was starting to read that out, and then I read the rest of it in my head, and I realized that you were fucking with me there. Good try, though. Good try, though. Uh, so let's see what we got. We want, like, decent armor, or, like, a decent helmet, but nothing too crazy. This is probably in the range I'm thinking of, 40 to 50. Head armor would be good. So let's see if we can find a good, like, elven-looking one. That, he just looks a little dorky with that on. Okay, let's let's put that away. Give me something. Something a little bit better. I mean, we could just go with one of these enchantments, right? And just get, like, a, a noble enchantment, 48. I feel like that'd be pretty decent. Plus three iron flesh is actually really nice. Um, We might just go with that, actually, for right now. Lintorn helmet, unless this looks good. Ah, no, I just, it's too, no. No, we'll, go, we'll just go for that. That'll work for the time being. All right, so we can just skip through these helmets until we get to the end, get to some of the OP ones. Black Hacken helmet? That looks kind of dope. All right, all right, all right. I'm liking what I'm seeing. Paladin helmet with hood, 74, 73, and 7. 75 and 5. So basically all these are, are the same. Okay. I need to get him some like some decent armor here. Nothing crazy. There's some Alvin Greaves will work. And then mittens. Oh shit. Now I'm gonna have to choose from these mittens now. Um something good but not too crazy. There we go. 
Look who's behind you. What do you mean? What do you mean? You think I can get it from the Mystic Merchant? You're talking about the Prisno Noble, like the silver armor or whatever, whatever the fuck that was? Dude, if you can, it's a GG right there. What is this? 7233? Urban Legion segment made by humans for humans? What the fuck? What? What is this? Why are they like advertising that was made by humans? Boys. I think we just found the dreaded one set of armor. We might have. We might have. This might be it. Let's see how. What is some of this shit? Travel stone. Okay, never mind. None of this shit's good. The Rula Leaf Bombs. Dreaded One Gauntlets. Okay. 11 body armor. Nothing crazy. 74 head armor. 71 and 36. Ooh. Ooh. Wait, where did it just go? Hold on, I put it back and then it just disappeared. Alright. It's 42. Nice, nice. Dark Lord Helmet. It's basically the exact same from the looks of it. Man. That looks beastly. Yeah. <laughs> Yo. Oh, man. I want to wear that so bad. I don't know if it fits our story at all, but it just looks so bad. So badass that, like, I want to try it out. That's nasty. Oh, it went up here. Yo. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> and the armor is good. There's nothing, like, outstanding. Like, it's not insane armor, but it's good armor. And it just looks so badass. I really want it now. Um, oh, we do need a bow. We haven't really seen any bows. Right? We haven't really seen any. Otherwise, I would have, like, remembered. <laughs> White Walker armor? What is this? What the fuck do you mean, White Walker armor? What? <laughs> what? Crossover? Is that what we're doing? A Clash of Kings? Prisno? Same thing now? What the hell? What is this troll armor? Requires 80 strength. Oh, we can't use it. Damn. What the fuck? Alright. Alright, bet. Okay. It's pretty cheap. 10k for an 80-80. Not bad. Alright. And so, actually, this is probably all the new armor that they've been adding. So maybe what he just meant by the dreaded one set is that we can now obtain the dreaded one set of armor in-game? Maybe that's what they meant by that. Yep, so here's all the giant shit. Okay. Bunch of shields. We do need a shield, actually. Um, and we don't need anything too fancy to start it off with, right? Just, I mean, just a decent kite shield should do. Yeah, I'll just grab that. Yeah, alright, this short U-bow is not, not going to cut it. And we'll get this instead, actually. Eh. Eh. Eh, I call it good enough. Good enough, good enough. Or maybe just a, one of these. One of these should work. We're almost out of money again. Okay. Good, good. Uh, Arrow-wise, what were we using before? I don't even remember. Let's grab some of these Geldrin arrows. Basically the same as what we already had there. Or no, were we using Elven Blood Arrows or Red Ranger Arrows? I don't remember. Maybe we were. Huh, I don't know. Okay, what bow were we using? We want something actually pretty decent because most of the bows suck in this game. Alright, I don't want to be doing like no damage again. Uh, Skywood Bow, that seems like that was about the same stats as we were using before. No, we had something with 10 power draw, didn't we? Is it this one, Black Ebony? We didn't get the Dark Forest Ranger Bow. That was the one we were looking for for the longest time. Let's get, like, the black ebony bow. Black ebony. Just like my porn. No. <laughs> That's jokes. Jokes, boys. Um, and what we're using? We're using, like, the elven noble sword. And obviously we had a masterwork version of it, but we don't, we don't have that anymore. So we're just going to have a regular one. Mm, Jesus, it's going to be like impossible to find a crimson sword. <sighs> God damn it. That's going to be frustrating. Green elven court blade. No. 
Would I? <laughs> what I'm wondering is, would I recognize this thing if I saw it? And I'm not sure that I would. Oh, here we go, right here. Elvish noble sword. Cool. Okay. I don't have seven thousand or seven thousand eight hundred eighty-eight orms. What's that look like, game? What's that look like to you? Yeah, that's money right there. That's fat stacks of orms, baby. <laughs> all right, next item range. We're getting close to the end here. I don't know where all the new weapons are. If they might just all be at the end all at once, it might be. What is this? Carver's axe. Okay, nothing too crazy here. Bastard sword, dark bastard sword. Wow, so edgy. Plus one damage. <laughs> Plus one damage due to edge. <laughs> Ancestral longsword. Okay, okay, all right, all right. That guy's it. So this is all the two-handed, one-handed stuff. Gotcha. Kingslayer. Excuse me. Hmm. What? One ten, one seventeen. Yo. Oh, we still need to get Skyfall. We should actually be able to get that a lot sooner in the series now. I'm not, Richard, I'm not sure if the Steam version updates automatically to 0 0.9. I'm not sure how that works. I don't use the Steam version because it's kind of fucked me over in the past when they automatically update and it ruins your save. That kind of sucks. So, the dreaded sword. Yo, look at that thing. Whew. 62 cunning damage. 100 speed. That'll do work right there. That will, in fact, do work. Nisanian's Legacy. Oh, 109 speed. Okay. We're almost there. We're almost there towards the end. At this point, it's it's like it's worth just seeing everything that there is. All right, there's only like one or two more ranges, so I want to see if like at the end, all of a sudden, they start putting some cool shit in. Demon Rune War Staff, huh? Those things actually slap. Are you kidding me? 54 cunning damage with a polearm. What? Okay, just some random shit. Civ Twilight Armor. Okay, so it doesn't actually have stats on any of these. Okay, so this, is just, this just might be random shit. That's what it looks like. Yep, and then that's it. Okay. Okay. All right, so we got Raleigh filled out now. We have... We don't have a horse. Elsinore, we're getting the first horse that I see. The second horse that I see. What is... Oh, I don't know if I like this new trade screen. My eyes are, like, hurt looking at this shit. What the fuck? Give me, give me the Elven Warhorse. Just give me that shit. I don't know if I like that shit, boys. Seriously, that like actually hurt my eyes, like looking at that shit. What the fuck? Um, okay. Right, let me see. Well, first off, we don't need the cheat menu anymore. We're done with that now. So let's do. No cheat menu. No. Stop it. There we go. Is it gone? Um, where do I turn off? Where do I turn off the new trade menu? Like, great try. I see what you're trying to do there, but I don't know. The UI on it just doesn't work for me. Where do I turn it off? It said it turn you can change it in the camp menu. That's what I'm doing. I went to the camp menu. Diplomacy preferences? Disable diplomacy, horse speed. Where do I do it? Oh, agent, you want me to look at the troop trees? Yeah, good call, good call. I forgot about that shit. The dwarves were updated big time. General options. All right, there's only three general option ones here, and it's uh, use ra use old random screen scenes. I don't think that's it. 
you missed I passed it general options like general options are right fucking here there is there a second general options what do you mean what do you, am I crazy I might be crazy sort parties sort player fees use old random screens scenes what do you guys mean BMP show what do you mean spider is a spider behind me okay we actually have a lot of spiders in the house, so it's not, <laughs> it's not like, impossible. Overworld options. There you go. Okay, thank you. No, fuck you guys that were saying general, general settings or whatever the hell it was. All right, boys, and so last thing we want to take a look at here are the troop trees going into this. Zan Heavy Riders. That seems new. Zan Damio? That also seems new. 200 proficiency, 480. Oh my god, and good ass armor too. What is? I always wondered what the Zam Kamikaze Warriors were. Where are the Zam Berserkers at? Hold up. Those are the real fucks. Those guys we actually hate. A Blade of Dragon Destiny. Okay, all right. They're just each one of their troops gets legendary weapons. I see how it is. That's cool. Um, so they said they added more Prisno infantrymen, right? Prisno guardsmen here. Okay, pretty good armor. Prisno champion, basically a two-handed unit, same type though. Okay. How good are the Great Knights? The Great Knights are decent. Okay. All right. Talrania, what do they get? This all looks the same for Talrania. Reich des Draken looks looking the same here. Drahara, Dune Guardian, are they new? I feel like these guys might be new. Alright. Makavia. This all looks the same. Elintor looks the same. Hack and Empire. Same. Realm of the Falcon. Same. Valhir Clan. What are these guys? Valhir Hilligords. I don't know if these guys are new because we haven't really fought the Valhir much. Might be Valhir Asbjarl. Asjarls. Whatever the fuck they are, they got they got a good bow. 450 archery with 10 power. Yeah, pen, 10 power draw. That'll do the trick. Spirit of the North? What the fuck? Yeah, that's a very good sword right there. Okay. Kakoth Confederation. What's new here? I'll be honest, I didn't really take a look too much, like, looking at the dwarf dwarves before us. So I don't know what's new. Mountain Keepers, I feel like they were always there, but this might have been some new armor. It will hold up. 80 and 30? 103 hit points? What are these guys? What the fuck? Outlander's death? 63 cunning damage? Iron Guardsman? Pretty fucking OP as well. Jesus. Okay. Geldar? Still looking shitty as always. Kratos Monarchy? Even shittier. Kulan Horde. Who? Giants. Look dope. Not actually that effective. Unless you have like a massive horde of them. A Rulo units. Okay. Rulo proven warrior. 41 piercing damage is actually pretty dope. And the armor, it's kind of shitty. It's kind of shitty. But is that too big of a surprise? It looks like it's made out of wood. Stats are pretty decent though. 93 health, 540 weapon proficiency. Woo! A beast master, he rides a fucking bear. Okay, what are these bears? 42 speed, so it's slow. Not too slow though, especially if you have a riding of 8. Um, 50 armor though, 340 hit points, pretty tanky. Pretty tanky, they get a spear along with it. Interesting, interesting. And then the Master Hurlers, that's what we want to know about. Yeah, the Leaf Bombs, baby. That's who we want. That's who we want. Throwing a 460. Yeah. All right, we're going to be getting some of those boys. Better count. What is this? The Ven Venatoran Empire. The Geldar would... The Geldar have been updated? All right, we'll go back. Oh, they have better stats now? All right. So no new units, just better stats. Okay. What the fuck are these guys? They look like the Third Legion. 
But it's like an actual faction. Oh, is this like... I wonder... Hold up. They said they had a major new quest for the Third Legion. Does it introduce them as an actual faction into the game? Because that would be fucking dope. That would be really cool, actually. I don't know if that's actually what's going to happen, but it might be. And then, so let's check out the minor, the troop trees for the minor factions. Um, I'm not seeing anything too crazy so far. Bandit's going to Knight of Doom at the top there. Okay, he's, he's pretty decent. He does have a Dwarven Crossbow, though. With a crossbow proficiency of 350, that's actually kind of scary. Nine horse archery, that'd do some work. That'd do some work right there. Player mercenaries. Oh, that's where we get to change all this shit. Nice, nice. Change first word for all. So what, instead of hired, it becomes something else? Hmm, okay. We'll have to play around with that later. That's all of it. Damn, it won't show us the stats for, like, the, the really OP units. That's too bad. The Venatorian Empire is the Third Legion. Oh. There's a new quest for them. There's an abandoned fort that you can spot. Okay. Go to references material. You can see the full troop trees later. There. Actually, hold on. Before we do that, I want to check out um, Geldar again. Since you guys are claiming they have really good stats now. Gelder and Dukes, 65, 86 health. I mean, like, good weapon proficiency. This is what I thought they basically were before, no? You know, decent armor, nothing too crazy. Like, it's, they're good units, but nothing crazy. Force Wardens, same here. What, like, were they just really weak before? Were they even weaker than what I thought they were before? I don't know, man. What's up, Shy? Geldar Blademaster, is this guy new? He might be. He's got that heavy scale mail armor that we were looking at. Hmm. He might be new. I mean, he's nothing crazy. Like, he's a DC unit, but nothing crazy. Foot Knights. Black Ebony Bow, that's what we're using right now. Gotta say, the Geldar Elves look sharp as fuck with that, like, the dark, the dark blue and, like, silver. <sighs> that looks dope. Whereas, Lintor... They're about that, I don't know, gold, gold and white. I mean, that can look decent at times. Something that is a little too gaudy. The straight crimson red, all right, that, that can be pretty dope as well. All the elves are, style, are stylish, okay? Chris Cole, you got Pathfinder Kingmaker because of me? Aw. Oh, well, I'm sure you're going to enjoy it, man. I'm sure you're going to enjoy it. If you ever need help, don't worry. You can check out my videos and watch me struggle through things. It's interesting, like, I've never, I've never started a new series before, like, on a new game, and had people, so many people tell me in the comments, hey, VMP, oh my god, I'm totally buying this game because of you, like, this game looks awesome. I've never had that happen before. Should have, like, talked to, like, the, like, creators of it and been like, yo, can I get, like, some, uh, referral, like, money out of this? Because seriously, I'm setting those guys up. I've, there's been at least ten people that have told me they're buying that game because of me. Yeah, Crimson Rangers are really good. Yeah, no, they definitely are. Geldar are the best cab archers in the mod, you believe? Hmm. It might be. It might be. Um, what else are we going to look at here? Oh, reference material? View all troops. Hmm. <laughs> No rune archer. Oh, this is the player fashion. Oh, 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 okay. I see what's going on here. Okay, okay. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Uh, Alright. <laughs> the Draken Meisters, lovely. That's what we like to see. So what I I'd really like to see actually are like the What are some of the new units that are coming out here then? It's hard to tell which new units are actually new or which of them are just household units for specific lords that we just haven't really run into much. Oh, I remember th there's one of them, there's one guy who owns like 
50,000 of these shadow assassins and he's impossible to defeat cuz that it's like the entire makeup of his of his army is just that man What's up Cody Vo? Well, yeah, you made it, man. Uh I don't really have a, a set time that I stream uh BMP show. I prefer to make episodes than to stream. Um generally, but it doesn't always happen. What time is it? 6.23. Okay. I just got to be out, out of here by like the next like 20 minutes or so. There's a Fortnite tournament going on tonight that I'm trying to take part in. See how I do. Probably get shit on, but that's okay. Realm of the Falcon. I'll be honest, I don't even really remember what we're looking for anymore. Okay, Koth units. Do we get to see them here? Doesn't really look like it. Kekoth Dreerg. 109 health. What the fuck? Okay. Kind of mediocre health, though. Geldar. Not even going to bother looking at these ones. Rulo. We've already seen all them. Okay, so that's everything. Where can I see the... um? Where can I see, like, the Parisno ones? Like, the Parisno per Rune Knights. That's what I want to see the stats do, cause some, and, like, you, and compare them to, like, the Paladins. Because you guys are telling me that the Parisno units are better. Oh, here we go. It's probably here. Hold on, hold on. Prisno White Knight. Nah, he's trash. Um, <laughs> oh, again, there. Prisno and Adventurer. Gladiator Champion. Arcane Defender. 70 health. But he's wearing the T Prisno Noble Armor. What the fuck? How's he so shitty but has armor like that then? All right, a bunch of Jin units here. Swordmaster. Batman? What? <laughs> Batman? Spiked Oak Bat of Doom? <laughs> That's funny. Does he actually show up in the game at all? That'd be cool to see. Just have him knock your whole party out. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. Now we're getting to that. Now we're getting to this shit. All right, Demon Death Knight. 123 health. <whistles> What's up, Jeremy? Uh, okay. All right. That's pretty good. 540 weapon proficiency there. Not bad. Not bad. What else you got for me? Hmm. <laughs> All right. So here's the Paladins of Faith. We've already kind of seen their stats before. 113 health, pretty decent, level 82, casual, 600 weapon proficiency, he's got, you know, 75 body armor there, 80-something head armor, 70, 80 leg armor, actually it's more like 85 body armor, okay, so they're, they're, they're pretty beefy, they're pretty beefy, dreaded doom guard, we're not, alright, let's not look at him, I'm trying to find the Prisno great knights, Prisno rune knights, here it is. So you guys have been telling me that these dudes are the best. These dudes are better. Less health. Less proficiencies by a little bit. A mace that's a little bit worse. Armor that's... Armor that the leg armor is a little bit better, I guess. I don't know, man. I still think the paladins are the best, best units in the game. That's just my opinion. Drakenmeisters are the coolest units in the game. I think the Paladins of Faith are the best units. I don't know. This is just me. This is just me. Yeah, this this stream should go up right away. Uh, the Arcane Knights are Arcanus's household units. Oh, okay, okay. Hmm. Dreaded Fallen, Wyverns, Red Immortals. They said they buffed the Red Immortals, right? Yup. Holy shit! 125 health. 650 weapon proficiency, 70 strength. Yo. These dudes 
And like, honestly, the armor's not even that crazy. It's like good, but not that crazy. But dude, these guys are gonna do an insane amount of damage. I'm not looking forward to having to do that quest. We didn't really do any quests so far this series. So I think we're gonna try to do that more. Is what's gonna happen. Right, let's look at the Dreaded Doom Guard real quick. Yeah, 130 health. Oh my god. Their axes are very short though. You can easily outrange them. Wow. Yeah, that sounds about right. That sounds about right. Alright, boys. Well, that's enough. I think that we're basically ready to go in that now. We're basically ready to go. I guess the only other thing I could do... Let me see here. Um, where would that be at? It'd be in, what, save games? If I go to Documents, Mountain Blade, Characters... Raleigh, I can edit that. Let's say instead of having 300,000 experience, he has like 50,000. And I'm not sure what level that puts us at. But it should be something about right. So let's, let's actually pop that up again just real quick. And change that again. Yep, sure shock. That's what that's what we're doing. We just finished setting up for that series. We, we, we that's literally what this whole stream has been. It's been us taking Raleigh from 0 0.8 and, and taking him to 0 0.9. But that's done now. We should be ready to go. Oh, you said I should start up a new series for 0 0.9? Uh, I don't know, man. We we weren't doing um We hadn't we hadn't accomplished too much yet. And I like the idea of Raleigh and uniting the two Alvin nations. Maybe in the future we can do a female giant. That'd be interesting. But uh, not this time, at least. Not this time. <laughs> Bahadir tried fighting a party in Noldor and Prophecy of Pandor. Well, that was your first mistake. Got headshot all the way from across the map. That'd be why. <laughs> That'd be why you don't do that. <laughs> you don't fuck around with the Noldor, man. Man, no joke. Oh shit, my internet stopped working again. Okay, well yeah, if you can get 100 Crimson, Crimson Rangers, by the way, you're just golden, man. You're not worried about anything. Anything or anyone. Alright, so let's see what this takes us to. 50,000 XP. It'll be the exact same stats, just 50,000 XP. Level 17. Okay, that's about where we were shooting for. So we can call it good there. We can call it good there. Hold up. So we have 31 strength and 13 iron flesh, but we only have 86 health. That doesn't seem right. Because if you have 30 strength and 10 iron flesh, you have 85 health. So why does... It's like it's not counting these extra 3 points of iron flesh that we should be getting. So hold it. If I take this off, it's still 86. Okay. So this... It looks like iron flesh doesn't actually help and add in past 10 due to uh, equipment modifiers. Alright. That's interesting. But alright. That's what we were looking for. I think we're good to go. So I'm going to try to record that. Probably end up recording that tomorrow. Um, and then Friday, that's going to come out, boys. Uh, we're, and I'm actually going to be here for once for a Friday. So I can make sure I'm uploading everything on time. And I think we'll go ahead and do the like goal on that. So we'll do like, um, I don't know, about 100, but maybe like 150. Every 150 likes, we get, uh, yeah, I think that's about right. Every 150 likes, I'll upload a new episode. Does that sound good? Why don't you leave him at level 1? Because that'd be a little too unfair. He has too good of stats to be considered like a level 1. And we'd get stats too quick. But like 17? I feel like that's pretty good. We'll still like experience leveling up. It's not like we're only going to level up like once every every episode. We'll level up like a couple times in the beginning. Um, but we should be good to go. So, anyways. Thanks to everybody who came out. Got a bunch of good work done. Um, tomorrow, probably going to have a Prophecy of Hendor out for you guys. Um... 
yeah, probably going to do Prophecy of Pandora for tomorrow. And then, uh, what's it called? What am I doing? Why is Reddit sending me messages? Fuck off, Reddit. <laughs> uh, and then, yeah, Friday, plan on Prisoner starting then. So until then, as always, take it easy, boys.